Good morning, good morning, good morning, you guys. It's your girl, the Retro Divine. I'm not coming with a quick little message with you guys. My message to you guys is this right here. Um, someone that you were in a relationship with or a friendship with that is a male was so, so jealous of you. So, so jealous of you, of your spirit, your giveness, the kindness, your love, everything. Me, that's a big old red flag. No man should be jealous of no woman unless that man wants to be a woman. This man, whoever he is, told all kind of lies, said all kind of things about you. You're about to find out some deep, dark secrets about this man. This man is bisexual. This man talked underneath your clothes. This man did all this stuff to you right here because this man wants to be you. This man wants your attention. This man wants your looks. This man wants it all. Okay, this man does not like the way people love at you. They, this, this man don't like your confidence that you have. This man tried to destroy you. This man tried to crush your confidence. This man tried to tell you this and he tried to tell you that to make you feel small, small about yourself. But nothing that the man did or said could affect you. And that really bothered him that he could not have control over you. He couldn't get in your mind and mind manipulate you and make you feel some type of way like he did every other woman that came along. See, he broke every woman down to make them feel like they needed him. Okay? With you, you showed him you didn't need him. You wanted him. And he thought that he thought that you were playing games with him. So he might, he manipulated you. He tried to manipulate you. He tried to get in your mind. He tried to tear you down. He tried to do all these things. Now this man is in deep regret. He is in deep regret because you are exposing him that he's bisexual. He's, he doesn't like that you're exposing his business. He doesn't like that you're speaking up about things that took place between you and him. He does not like that you have found the strength to speak up and he wants you to be quiet. Let me tell you something. You don't be quiet for nobody. You open your mouth and you say what you have to say no matter who it affects. You heard me? Make sure your heart, all your chakras is aligned. Your throat chakra, your heart chakra, your solar plex chakra, everything is aligned. Make sure you're speaking your truth and standing in your truth. No matter who try to stand against you, no matter who try to stop you, no matter what the circumstances the situation may be. Always be true and honest and faithful to you. Always speak on you. What you need? Relevance. Always speak on you. Always be... Always, um, always tell your truth. You know, don't let nobody else tell you your what your truth should be. This this man is so jealous of you till it makes any sense for this man to be this jealous of a female. This man wants to be you so bad. So he thought by. Hold on, you guys. Let's find an advance for my daughter. He thought by by tearing you down, by speaking negative against you, by talking under your clothes, by saying stuff to you, that it was not going to get anybody to want to fool with you, anybody to have nothing to do with you, but it did the opposite of that. And now people are starting to see this man for who he is, a liar, a manipulator, a game player, um, a clown, because that's who he really is. He's a clown. He's a clown because... You, huh, huh, like, you as a grown man are in competition with a woman, a whole female, something you came from. You came from a woman and you intimidated by a woman. You so intimidated by a woman that you decided to try to tear her down because you didn't like the position that she was in. You didn't like that she loved herself. You didn't like that she healed. You didn't like that she was a nurturer. You didn't like that she was a mother. You didn't like whatever she is. I guarantee you this same man who does this neglects his children. He don't take care of his children. He talks to his mama like crap. He treat women like crap because he is so intimidated and jealous of a woman. He really wished that he was a woman. Nine out of 10, he was a woman in his past life. And he just, and I guarantee you his package is not big. His package is very tiny. And he is very intimidated by that. Because he cannot fulfill what he wants to fulfill with a woman. So he will try to tear her down to belittle her. Whoever this person was, this 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 person showed you who they really were plot twist about this thing is that this person wants to come back into your life 
try to act like they're sorry for the things that they said or whatever. But this person was all in your face and, and putting daggers behind your back. Like I've been telling y'all, y'all have to be aware of the smiling faces. Beware of people who say they for you but not really for you. All that I love you and all the rest of that stuff. Beware of people showing you fake love. And really getting in your circle to stab you in your back either which way you can. To get your children taken, to rob you of money, to get you homeless, to get you depressed, to get you insane, to make you look crazy, to make you look like you this type of way. They would do uh, and nothing to stop you, to bring you down, to make you feel some type of way because they are jealous and they're intimidated by you and they want to be you. They want what you have. They want your knowledge. They want your looks. They want your love. They want to be seen in a way that people see you and they're not being seen in their light by their parents by their lovers by their children by their employees by their co-workers by their neighbors by nobody and they're jealous and they're intimidated of that continue to press your way forward continue to do you continue to be you wholeheartedly always be true to who you are no matter what anybody is doing to you nobody what nobody said about you continue to be your true and authentic self because your authenticity is 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 bringing people in your authenticity is helping people heal your identity is making the truth be revealed see all the lies and stuff that was told on you you being who you really are to your hardcore is showing people Hey, this person is lovable. This person is sweet. Oh, I see why you had so much to say against this person. Because you love this person. You want to be with this person. But this purpose, the person did not want to accept what you were bringing and who you were. So now you decided to lie on this person. Now you, deli you decided to spread all kind of false gossip and all the rest of this on this person. Allow people... Allow people to do them and you do you at every angle allow them to say and do whatever they want long as you being true to who you are and knowing who you are and allowing god to lead and guide you to where you are going you will be just fine whoever this jealous person is they're getting karma out of zazu you hear me they're getting so much of karma right now for the things that they did and they thinking that trying to make things right with you will him will stop their karma from happening it's not going to stop their karma from happening that karma is still going to happen but Still pray for this person because this person is going through an identity crisis. This person does not know who they are. This person never had any genuine, honest, authentic people in their life. And when someone never had anyone in their life who's genuine, honest, and authentic, they choose to take over that. They choose to take advantage of that. They choose to dog that. They choose to walk that, walk over that. Choose to be jealous of that because they haven't experienced it. Everybody's so used to taking it from them, showing them fake love. So when the real one come around with some real love and being a true, authentic self and try to help them grow, they're going to try to stab you. They're going to try to stop you. They're going to try to downplay who you really are because they have not ran into someone like that before. So I don't know who that message is for, but that's the message that I have for you guys. It's your girl, The Real True Divine Feminine. Please like, share, and subscribe. And you guys have a blessed and prosperous day. Peace.